A bearded war hero who was wounded in combat while fighting with the elite SEAL Team 6, secretly cross-dressed as a woman for decades, now is undergoing hormone therapy for a sex change. Is this the original story to Mrs. Doubtfire? Mm -hmm. (laughs) So you have this Navy SEAL, Chris Beck. He's 46. He now goes by Kristen instead of Chris. (laughs) Creative. Detailed her battle, going by her now, of course, detailed her battle with identifying as a woman in the SEAL's tough guy world in a new autobiography, Warrior Princess. <gasps> That's such a good title. The twice married father of two boys was deployed 13 times to Afghanistan and Iraq, earning a Purple Heart and a Bronze Star. I'd say good for her. <laughs> he was part of the Allied forces that took Saddam Hussein's palace, was hit by shrapnel twice, almost broke his back during training. But the carnage he saw in his two decades as a SEAL forced him to suppress his true gender identity, which at the time was, quote, a girl somewhere between 11 to 16. Now, to me, that's hot. That'd be like uh, if I'm thinking I'm somebody, then I look like not just sexuality I'm changing. I'm changing the age. Keith, why didn't you do what you said you were going to do? Because I'm a 12-year-old boy. (laughs) I'm a jerk Well, don't you think they're trying to say that they're emotionally this age because they're not fully developed as a woman yet. They were yes. stunted. Would, that, stunted would that be what they're trying to say? I see that. That's, that's what I was thinking. He says, I hope to become, quote, normal, and I fathered another son. He confessed to his second wife. He said, look, I like to wear pantyhose sometimes. I like to dress up like a girl. You should know this about me. Now, uh, is she a lesbian? She, like, I sincerely... What do you mean? Um, does she want to stay with her wife? Does she want to be, when she becomes right. a woman, stay with women? Thank yeah. you. The pronouns throw me a little oh, bit, sorry. of course. Um, no. He, uh, she, the wife says, fuck you. You're, quote, disgusting. That's what she said? Yeah, but this is fair to say, Mateo. He say, he's saying, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be your husband and have kids, and then goes, hey, by the way, not for nothing, after my second kid, I, I think I'm really a girl. No, 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 and then, not- and, and the wife is, a, is an asshole because she can't handle it? No, I no, didn't say she was all. an asshole. That's what I sounded like. No, 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 no. I'm, <laughs> not, I'm not asking about the person who was uh, an outer woman the whole time. I get it. She's, she's straight. She's into men. So when he transitioned, uh, it's very fair for her to just be out because that's yeah. not what she's into. And I'm- angry. Oh, abs- sure. Yeah, she, because yeah, be you've, you've been lying to me for right. a very long time, and and I expected you to be with me as you know. A man. I there's certain expectations. I married a Navy SEAL. I mean, yeah. who gets the fucking Navy? I know. Seal? Can you imagine her brunch the next day yeah. with her like friends? Yeah. So yeah, how's you're... Tom? Well, it's Tommy. It's Tanya. <laughs> it's Tammy. You know, yeah, mm. it's Tammy. <laughs> it's Tammy. Wait, the Tammy you know really is a lesbian. Yes, I'm good. Yes. Um, no, but the, the person uh, the person who transitioned are is that person into female or men? Because uh, you know what I mean. Does it's a men? I guess no. I guess it, women. it doesn't always have to happen that way. I ask her. I guarantee she's into men. Call her up. <laughs> no, Get her on the line. You, you know what I mean? Like if Lauren transitions, she's still into women. You know. Oh, who? Oh, who is the Navy Seal in? Yeah, let's call her. Sorry, come on. Sorry, guys. let's call her Navy Seal. I, see, I'm saying she because okay. I know. I'm yeah. like, I'm like, yeah, it's a she now. Okay, so but who, he's confused out of his sorry. goddamn mind because yeah, there's two she's here. Yeah, sorry. So yeah. who is the Navy Seal into? Is the Navy Seal into female or man or men? Like, was was men, the Navy men. S- really? Yes. So he had been just tired. It'd be one thing, but if at he, war. But he's at, he, he shouldn't have had kids. Right. He shouldn't have had, well, not that he shouldn't have had kids, but that's going to be the most traumatizing part because it's like, if you knew that's how you felt, you wanted to be with men and you wanted to become a woman because that's who you are, why are you dragging so many other lives into this? Well, I think the kids can get over it a lot quicker than the, the wife. The kids can, but the wife isn't what I'm the, thinking about. The wife is who made the promise to this person. The, the, the Navy SEAL said, I will love you because I love you as right. this person. And now uh, the Navy SEAL's wife has to be like, I'm getting divorced for not what I expected. Do you know what I mean? Like, you promised this thing. As as kids, it's like, look, kids, you know, this is what happens in life. Like, um, Navy SEAL could have been, you know, with a male partner the whole time and then transitioning. It's just a conversation that you have. I get that it's new and uncomfortable and, you know, whatever. But your wife, man, your wife expected these things. Yeah. Let's see. He now works as Pentagon security uh, for a Pentagon security contractor. He posted a photo dressed as a woman on LinkedIn, and he said, I am now taking off all my disguises and, I, and letting the world know my true identity. He's got to be pretty buff, though, if he's a, a Navy SEAL, though, Yeah, those right? are going to be huge tits, yeah. 
Uh, his <laughs> SEAL colleagues were supportive. Good. I love how they're the supportive ones. <laughs> right. That's... Everyone else is like, no! And they're like, yeah, I don't care. He's a great shot. Being wow. a SEAL is hard. This looks harder, said one pal. Another said, I'll drink a beer with him anytime, anywhere, for any reason, no matter how you are dressed, especially if you're buying. He said that drunk, by the way. That's... Right. And then the Navy SEAL said, I don't pay for drinks anymore. <laughs> yeah. Yes, never do. <laughs> That's actually really funny. <laughs> Yeah, but dab a do. Yeah, but Timely, <laughs> timely. <laughs> um, once he was, the Navy SEAL was at a bar and he's dressed as a woman. A man comes over, tries to hit on her and says that he's a Navy SEAL and he can tell right away he's lying and it's bullshit and he knocked him the fuck out oh, as a woman. Snap. What is this story? Why is that relevant and who wrote that story? I don't story? know, but it's funny. <laughs> We're going to the real serious thing in the end. It's like, by the way, she's knocking guys out right and left at the bar. What the fuck does that have to do with anything? And then it says women The power. family's in torture. And we, do I give a shit if she's knocking people out at the bar? Great. <laughs> Asinine. It's funny, though. Yeah. Look, it, <laughs> it is. I mean, am I, am I wrong? Like, how, how desperate is that newspaper? Right. <laughs> before, Always. Before they punt, before the Navy SEAL hits them, like, does she go, like, ah, word to the wise. When you're not a Navy SEAL, don't pretend you are. Yeah, boom. <laughs> Geekandthegirl.com.